Hi there guys, I'm Nikhil from Notion Hub. In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable or disable the itch panels feature on your Samsung phone. For a quick reference, this is the itch panel. It's only available on few Samsung high-end phones and this is how you can customize it. These are all the pre-installed itch panels and you can enable or disable them just by doing this. Just click on the toggle and these are all the itch panels that are enabled. Once again, here's the preview. Just swipe on them to switch between different panels. Now to enable or disable this particular feature, this is what you can do. Go to settings, select display, scroll down a bit and you can find a toggle for edge panels. So here we have it. You can enable or disable the panels directly from here. Now you can customize it directly from here. These are all the existing panels and you can also download more from the Galaxy store. These are some of the famous ones. Most of them are paid, but we also have some decent free ones as well you can find it in the top free section. Besides that, you can also change other stuff like the handle's location and color from here. Now it's a bit more visible. So this is the edge panel. This particular edge panel is mostly used for opening split screen applications, where you can use two applications at the same time. Now, as you can see, I've opened two applications at the same time. And if you click the button at the center, we get some extra options to shuffle them or save this particular combination in the edge panel. Besides that, you can also just drag and drop any of these applications at the center to open that application in a floating window or a pop window.